Yo, what is the deal, YouTube, man? It is later in the night. Later in the night. Y'all know my favorite time. We're going right here to door 10. Can't see Jack Diddley's spot. Hope I don't hit nothing. You feel me? Maybe I, if I do though, it's nighttime. Ain't nobody gonna know nothing. Uh-huh. We are going right here to door 10. I'm picking up this water load. Very easy, very light. Dang, thought I had it first try. Guess I'm not a driver. Oh well. Come on, Tez, catch it. What the heck? Come on, Tez, catch it. What the heck? Nope. Always lined up pretty good because the arrow had one off. When that arrow go off, that yellow that y'all see, that means you lined up. If that arrow don't go off, boy, you ain't lined up, twin. Let's see. Oh. No arrow. But we are picking this up. This is a short load. It's only going 400 miles um, down the way. It is freaking midnight. So, yeah. I got here at like 11, I think. I don't know. I really just got here, honestly. But let these boys get us loaded. Oh, dang. Red light already. That's what we're talking about. So, it should be a quick load. I'll tap back in with y'all when they done. All right, y'all, it's currently four in the morning, man. Just now got loaded. <sighs> Start eight. It's all right, though. Little Tuesday vibe, man. It is what it is. I ain't too much tripping. Loads will get better. Things will get better. It is what it is. But I'll see y'all when we get back in the truck and we head it out. Let's do it. All right, y'all, we are on roll. Um, Man, it's 445 miles. A little six hour drive. You know what I'm saying? And I'll probably pick up some when I get there, maybe. Who knows? Um, but it's crazy. I was there for a long time for a bunch of nothing. See what it is though. I ain't too much tripping on it. So um, I do need to get fuel. I really wanted to drive through the night though because I don't want to deal with the idiots. But it is what it is. Yo, yo, what's the dealio? I have not been recording y'all because it's literally everything that y'all saw yesterday. I'm literally going back down the same way. So I have not been recording, but we have just pulled up to the Flying J pilot, whatever you want to call it. Uh, I'm about to go ahead and grab some fuel. Probably, if it's a shower available, I am going to grab a shower too. Might as well kill two birds with one stone. Nice. Nah, it's sad. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to find an open pump though because you may be not trying to wait in line and all that shenanigans and who nanny and all that. So. I'm about to grab one of these pumps. It shouldn't be much to fill up. Y'all should be proud of me. I didn't let my fuel run low. I actually, you know what I'm saying? Took care of it. Uh, uh, I don't know. Over here. Down over yonder. Let's go ahead. Let's grab this fuel real quick and we'll be Gucci. Okay, it is only right that I clean these windows. Should be quick. It's starting to get chilly out in the morning, boy. Woo! It's gonna be a cold, cold winter. Uh, 
had to take a little trash out. First trash bag in here. Well, I was about to shower right now, but the wait for a shower is currently like, it's like two people ahead. So I'm just about to go ahead, eat some breakfast and get back on the road. Hurry off for this. Pull that top part open like that. Boom. Poke a hole through the bottom like that. Put some air through. One minute in here. I'm Gucci. Boom, perfect. Let that cool down up here. Throw this in like that. Y'all can see, man. We are 45 minutes away. I was trying to be a good Samaritan and stop at the freaking way station. I shouldn't have stopped, bro. I should have just blew the scale, bro. I usually always blow the scale. I was like, you know what? I'm going to be good today and just go ahead and hit the scales. I shouldn't have done that. But I probably should take this GoPro off my head. Pretty much, I'm about to hit this stop sign up here. Once I hit that stop sign, I'm just keep rolling and going. So let me take this off real quick while I get up here like that your boy is done as you can see they got a truck pulled over right here truck right here they just out to get you to dang he dealing with two trucks or not just one what oh sir ski and all these other trucks bypass the way station exactly what i should have freaking did wasting my time see this is why i'd be going past way stations bro it's literally just a waste of time appreciate you bro finally about to be out of north carolina north kakalaki and I don't know, bro, on a 95, I feel like they've been doing this same construction. If you're a driver, you know. They've been doing this same construction since I don't know when, bro. Probably, I've been I've been driving, I think since I started over the road four years, five years ago. Oh, all right, this time I did not look like, a, I, I did not look like, I didn't look for a load of coming back because I want to take a shower. And then while I'm in the shower, I'm gonna look. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna, I'm gonna see what's up with some loads. Um, see what some folks got to offer. Um, I'm not on a contract currently right now. And contracts is usually actually how I make the most money out here. But I'm not on one right now, which is cool. Cause I get back on one. I'm working on something right now, but I'm just like hustling right now. I'm not gonna lie. I will be pissed off. Oh my goodness, I will be pissed off. Everybody stuck behind a little house. No, sir. Absolutely not. Uh, but yeah, so I'm just really like, I'm not working off the low board. I just know like, I know some people who know some people who can, uh, get me right you know what i'm saying so that's really what i've been doing um that's why i don't care to do like short mile loads because i still get paid good you know what i'm saying i don't need you know i'm I, I technically i get paid by the mile when it comes to like dollar per mile or whatever it is but not really you know what i'm saying like i don't know how to really explain it if you're not a truck driver if you're a truck driver you know what i mean i don't get paid like CPM cents per mile. But in, in a sense I do, depending on like how much, what's the rate going for the load. If that makes sense, I don't know if that makes sense to y'all, but it makes sense to me. And if it makes sense to me, that's all that really matters because I'm the one explaining it. Not gonna lie. But yeah, um, we are almost there, 42 minutes away. I don't really like to show y'all everything we done already saw. This is pretty much stuff we done already saw when we was going up that way. I'm going back down. So yeah, I'll tap back in with y'all. All right, y'all, we done pulled up to the spot. We're going to door 10. And ironically enough, that's the same door that I got what's the name in yesterday. Yeah, why I gotta be somebody walking? Hurry your apple head ass up. Damn. But ironically enough, that's the same door I got loaded in last night. Let's go ahead and open up these doors real quick. Mm. 
Y'all want to know what I got in there? These are caps for water bottles. Y'all see how I say right there? Caps. These are all water bottle caps. So that's what goes onto your water bottle. So y'all need to say thank you, Tez, for delivering the caps to the water bottles. Boy, for me, y'all, I had no cap for the water bottle. Y'all think I can get this in first try? Nope. All right, no. Oh, my goodness, lady. Get the hell out the way, nah. I just thought about that. Nope, and I'm still not lined up. Well, I'm too far on this line. I freaking knew it. But, go put this paperwork in the trailer. Let me get all these straps out. So be on some crybaby shit. You need this paperwork? <laughs> There you go. I know, right? Thank you. Well, GoPro off my head. God damn. We did end up getting unloaded. I just came over here to the pilot and I hope I packed everything in a shower bag because I already booked the shower and I don't want to miss it. So let me just run through here real quick. Yeah, pretty sure I got everything. A rag, some socks, a towel, a shirt, some underwear. What do you know? I don't have any shorts in here. Good thing I just freaking looked, because I would have been sick. Boom, boom. I think I got some shorts right here, though. Yo. Oh. Just like that. We are good. I'm glad I freaking looked. Grab that and that. All the parking spots in the truck stop, and a nigga want to park next to me. What the fuck? All the parking spots. Fuck you want to park next to me for cornball? Damn, I hate people. Let me hurry up and go get in the shower though. Because I did already book it. Uh -uh. And y'all smell bad, so y'all need a shower for real. I don't need a shower for real, but y'all do. Let go! I must admit. Walking through the trucks, gotta be top five worst smells in the world, bro. Cause everybody is too lazy to get out and go pee 
in the bathroom or pee in a bottle and then put it in the trash everybody just get outside their truck and then pee so it just stank all the time that's top five worst smells maybe even top three worst smells walking in between the trucks when you go into a shower your best bet get out walk around all the trucks you ain't got to smell that fence boy that made me sick and i think my shower about to go away i literally have like one minute but i think i'm gonna make it i'm low key like booking it for the shower it's only three showers one two six one yeah i'll do it time That always gotta be off, be too cold. Anyway, watch this, hold on, y'all ready? My outfit gonna look like I didn't change, but I promise I did. <sighs> all right, y'all, and your boy is all fresh and all clean. These are not the same clothes, I promise. My dirty clothes are right here, gray shorts and a white shirt somewhere down there, hold on. White shirt, yes sir. Now, let's go back to the truck. To the truck. Y'all, we done hopped out the shower. Everything. We are here at Ryder. I don't know if y'all remember, I blew a tire in the last video. It rubbed like crazy. Tire and debris. I don't know if that rod's supposed to be bent. Who knows? But, put a hole in the airbag right there. And what we did was we just bypassed the line, basically. So it will hold air. Like, that's literally what we did. Um, right now we are about to uh get this bag replaced should be that long shouldn't be too much to do uh and then i think we'll be all good so let's go get this fixed they end up getting the airbag fixed man um but it's currently nighttime i'm in the bed and i do got a load y'all know i love driving at night so that's what i'm doing tonight i love y'all i appreciate y'all thank y'all for still tuning in if you tuned in but as y'all know, this load will be on the next one. Peace.